time that you're performing at the Blue Star, if I got it right. Yeah, yeah, it's uh, the first time. Not my first time in Germany, because mm -hmm. I often come and play in Germany. But um, yeah, my first time here, so I'm, I'm really happy. Mm -hmm. Have you ever heard about this festival before? Yeah, yeah, for sure, because uh, um, I follow uh, the festival on mm -hmm. Instagram, Facebook and everything. And I saw um, every pictures uh, on backstage. Mm -hmm. it, it's such a wonderful program every year. So a lot of people that uh, uh, inspire me a lot. So uh, Maceo Park uh, and everything. So yeah, yeah, it was not the first time I heard the, the name of the festival. And uh, it's a really long day for you. You had to yeah. get up at five o'clock. <laughs> yeah, yeah, true. I, we woke up at five uh, this morning. We left Paris. And it was a seven hours trip, so uh, yeah, so we were really happy to arrive and everything. And, yeah, but it's okay, it's okay. We used to do it, so that, that's fine. <laughs> You're touring a lot, you mentioned yeah. it before, yeah. performing a lot in Germany. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I think since seven years now, uh, I have a nice team uh, who work for me there. So, um, yeah, we did a lot of towns, a lot of cities, uh, a lot of festivals, a lot of venues in Germany. So it's always a pleasure to come because I think the German um, audience is uh, really curious to discover uh, that kind of music. I mean, soul, funk music. So, um, yeah, it's really nice to come and, and play my music there. Mm. Good tonight, Rot. Yeah, you're good. Even if it's Sunday, you're good. You ready for party? Yes. Before starting a new week, I just wanted to say I'm really, really, really happy to be back in Germany. It's always a pleasure to visit you and play my music for you. Yes, that's true. Just the truth. <laughs> Thank you. So tonight, we're here to introduce to you a new album just released last September. It's called Jump. 
So I hope you will enjoy it. Please show us, show us if you enjoy it, okay? We're gonna continue with the song entitled, I Wanted to Kiss. Thank you for coming tonight. I love you. Thank you. family I've read uh, you grew up mainly with jazz yeah uh, yeah yeah not, not really not really my, my parents are not musicians but um, but yeah they played a lot of music at, at home and every weekend uh, it was more like rock music uh, my dad is a big fan of Rolling Stones Lou Reed David Bowie my mom is um, it's more Prince Lenny Kravitz so um, I discovered the blues and the jazz music more by myself when I grew up and I was a teenager. So uh, yeah, music is really important in, in my family. How did you discover especially the blues? I think I discovered it because I started to play the guitar. So uh, I was around 12 and uh, yeah, I just fell in love with this music. I, I think I, I discovered probably B.B. King first or something. And uh, yeah, I fell in love with this music because um, um, I wanted to be a, a real guitar hero. And, uh, and yeah, it's, it's so authentic. It's, uh, it's, I think it's the roots of every kind of music. So yeah, it was really important for me at that time. And, and yeah, I kept it. Mm -hmm. But your big idol or role model is Prince. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, is is my idol because I love everything. Uh, I mean, I love. Is uh, is a great guitar player. Is a great singer. Is a, a great songwriter, uh, and he can he can do the show uh, like yeah something really huge and with with uh, some some dance and and really party and so uh, yeah, is my idol for every point of of his music. Yeah, it inspired me a lot. Mm -hmm. the traditional blues where there are a lot of elements in it mm -hmm. where, mm -hmm. uh, for me it's kind of young blues where you're having hip-hop jazz mm -hmm. soul funk yeah. everything in it mm -hmm. so I guess may you also having a quite young audience um, 
Yes, not so young because um, yeah, it's like you like you said. I try to to mix every music that I like. Uh, I'm 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 really inspired by um, hip hop and R and B also. So I try to mix everything and and I try to keep this music. I mean the blues alive and. Um, yeah, it has to be attractive to young people. So it's not easy every day, but yeah, we try. We try to do it because I think it's a, it's an important thing to uh, to keep it alive. So um, yeah, we try. We try to mix everything. Mm -hmm. You're singing English normally, yeah. but on the new album mm -hmm. Jump Your, uh, it's the first time that you sang two songs in French. Yeah, um, two songs and and few. A uh, few bridge and few chorus uh, on other songs in, in in French too, but um, yeah, it's um, I think it's because uh, on this album uh, there are few songs more personal, and I wanted to to be really clear, you know, and direct uh, with my French audience. So I needed to express myself in my in my own language. So it was in, important for me to do it. So. Um, yeah, step by step, I yeah integrate some French yeah. songs in my music, and that's fine. I like it. I like it. I think it's difficult. Ma I wouldn't dare to write English lyrics myself. Ma mm -hmm. could try, yeah. but, but would need help of somebody. Do you have somebody who helps you? Um, I'm usually I always um, write uh, the songs by myself and after that I speak and yeah I show my my lyrics to uh, English or American people most of time American people so they can help me and and say no this is not correct or you can say it or you can say that blah 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 so um, yeah so a few persons help me to um, yeah, to have the final lyrics, mm -hmm. but um, I always write by myself mm -hmm. first. Mm Encore plus, encore plus grande comme une utopie, un enfant égaré. Bah. 